to show you something very interesting. These trolls who obsessively go after Bible-believing Christians, they have the spirit of a Pharisee. They're doing the exact same thing the Pharisees were doing towards Jesus Christ in the Gospel accounts. The Pharisees were just following Jesus around and, and nitpicking and looking at every little thing he does and trying to find stuff to, stuff to accuse him on. The exact same thing these uh, trolls do. King's Table, Ed Fenninger, Max Bauer, these other guys. I'm going to show you they have the spirit of a Pharisee. So, first go to Luke chapter 11, verse 52 to 54. I've read this verse in another video, but I'll read it for you again. It says, Woe unto you lawyers, for ye have taken away the key of knowledge, and entered not in yourselves, and them that were entering in ye hindered. But look at verse 53 and 54. As he said these things unto them, the scribes and the Pharisees began to urge him vehemently, and to provoke him to speak of many things. Look at verse 54. Lying in wait for him, and seeking to catch something out of his mouth, that they might accuse him. Hmm. Another verse about this is Luke chapter 6, verse 5 to 7. Go there. Because you're going to see this theme of there just looking at every, every little thing he does and trying to find little mistakes he makes to go after him. Luke chapter 6, verses 5 to 7. You see the same thing here. Luke chapter 6, verse 5 to 7. It says, And he said unto them, this is Jesus speaking, that the Son of Man is Lord also of the Sabbath. Verse 6. And it came to pass also on another Sabbath that he entered into the synagogue and taught. And there was a man whose right hand was withered. And the scribes and Pharisees watched him whether he, he, he would heal on the Sabbath day that they might find an accusation against him. So again, they're trying to find the little mistakes he makes and trying to go after him and trying to accuse him of things. Exactly what these trolls do. Uh, final place, Matthew chapter 22, verse 14 to 15. Matthew chapter 22. Oops, hit the wrong button. And I do apologize, I'm not the best at reading on a computer, so... Uh, I do plan on getting a paper King James Bible, just haven't gotten around to it. Matthew chapter... what was it? Uh, 22... Sorry, let me check back my notes. Verse 14 to 15. Chapter 22, verse 14 to 15. So we see uh, the same theme here again. Uh, it's Jesus speaking. For many are called, but few are chosen. Look at verse 15. And then, or so that then went the Pharisees and took counsel how they might entangle him in his talk. So, all through these verses, you see the Pharisees who are just following Jesus around and just obsessively going after him and looking at every little thing he does and trying to find any little mistake they can on him to accuse him and, and lie about him, basically. These people that stalk us, uh, Max Bauer, Ed Fenninger, King's Table, Jason Singerling, all these guys, they have the spirit of a Pharisee. They look at every little thing you say, look at every little video you put out, they lie about you, they falsely accuse you, and they, they look for little mistakes you make, they, they just will comb your videos, binge watching everything you do to find a, a mistake you make, and then they find that mistake, they'll just blow it out of proportion, they'll just twist your words, totally just twist what you're saying, exactly as the Pharisees were doing. You know, their, their, um, what was it verse 15 says? Then the Pharisees went and they took counsel about how they might entangle him in his talk. They're trying to entangle you in, their, in your talk. They're Pharisees. They have the exact same spirit that a Pharisee has. So, I had to get that out there because uh, if you start making Christian videos, if you start preaching real biblical uh, truth from the King James Bible, you start uh, talking about and promoting things that the Word of God promotes and biblical doctrines, you're going to find these people who just obsessively go after you and just look at all your videos you put out. They're going to flock to your channel and just make their own videos about you and just, just stalk you, essentially. That's what it comes down to. And, and just remember, they, 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 the Pharisees did the exact same thing to Jesus. So it's going to happen to you too. You're going to have people that just look at every little thing you do and just, you know, they're stalkers, they're Pharisees. They have the same spirit that a Pharisee had. So don't be deceived and don't be don't be discouraged. When this, when this kind of stuff happens to you, when you have these trolls who just obsessively stalk you, uh, don't, don't be discouraged because, again, they did the exact same thing to Jesus. So you're just going through what Jesus went through. So... Don't be, uh, don't be discouraged. Don't be deceived. God bless you. Goodbye.